All right, guys, um, considering the nature of uh, this playlist, um, which may or may have varying degrees of successfulness, um, I figure I should wear the spider dog suit. Um, I actually got in an argument with somebody the other day online about something, and he commented that my profile picture um, is Spider-Man, and I'm like, haha, joke's on you, it's spider dog. Um, said he couldn't take anybody serious who would dress up like this well. I shouldn't be taken seriously. Anyways, um, so this was something I mentioned, I think in like the second, third video I showed you guys, um, which is a different type of uh, shoulder roll. And the first thing I kind of want to get you guys to be able to do is just be able to do the roll. And so a lot of times what this is going to be is like if somebody stands up and I'm in this kind of uh, defensive open guard position. Um, and what I want to do is I want to come close to the knee, right, with this. Um, and if I can, I want to kind of start to turn my hand the dire direction I want to go. So I'm going to go palms down, thumb in. So this is going to be their left leg, right, um, if they're standing up. So there's going to be another leg here. And so what I want to do here is I want to uh, put my head under my arm. Right? And in order to do that, one of the key elements that you really need to be paying attention to is that you have one point of contact on the mat at, at any given time. So you should be able to move really, really freely through this. Um, so if I'm here, that's it. That's, that's what I kind of want you guys to start off with practicing here. Is just go here and bring your head under and around. Right? And so most of the time, I'm rolling between my shoulder blades right on the uh, scapula there and going through between the rhomboids, right? So it's actually relatively high on my back. Um, you can do it on your kind of mid to low back too, but it's, um, especially for where we're going with this, um, I kind of want it a little bit higher, I guess in the area between where like the uh, lumbar and the thoracic spine are is, is probably one of the more optimal spots. So I'm here, roll, and through. And didn't give myself enough momentum there, but that's that's perfectly fine for right now. What I really want you to be focusing on is as little contact as humanly possible. This bar moved. So here, and I'm in this seated position, guys. Um, when I start this movement, it's this thing, right? It's just a shoulder roll to begin with to get myself down. So I'm going to drop and you see where my hips are. My hips are off the ground. So I've got that little tiny point of contact so I can easily move and easily spin on the ground. So, one last time. I'm here. And I come to the other side. All right. So that is your basic MNRE roll. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start applying that here in a second. 